Hello everyone. Hope you all are doing well. Today I am going to show how to hide catalog item for a certain group of users or for uh, other group of users. Okay. Let's see. Log in to your personal instance. Now go to maintain items. Maintain items. Okay, now select the item which you want to show only for specific users. Okay, or which you don't want to show for specific users. Okay, let's take this create user catalog item. So under this catalog item, okay, you have available for. Okay, so you can choose to whom this catalog item is available for, okay, or not available for. We can choose like to whom this catalog item is not available for, okay. For example, if I go to available for, okay, and if we already define some criteria, okay, uh, like user criteria to whom it is to for which group of which users. Okay, if you already defined, okay, you can go and edit and add the user criteria. For example, if I go and edit, so I will get all the user criteria listed. Okay, but now I will create uh, one user criteria. I will not use. I will create a new user criteria. So let's see. Click on new. Okay, for example, uh, only for only for ITIL users. Okay, only for ITIL users. Okay, so what I will do, I will go to the roles. Okay, and I will select only ITIL user. Okay, ITIL user and submit. So that means it is available for only ITIL users. Let's test it. Okay. Uh, this is catalog item is uh, create user under service catalog category is user. Okay. Let's impose net um, do one thing. Let's uh, go to the portal view. Okay. Let's go to the portal view uh, service portal. Okay, now go request something. Under administrator user. Okay, because I am a admin, I can see it. Okay. Create user. If I click on create user, this is the catalog item. Okay, now go to service catalog. Now, uh, we define this catalog item should be available only for ITL users. Okay, let's impose native with end user. Okay. Let's impose it with end user. We'll see. Joy employee is a end user. We'll see if this item is a, he can able to see or not. Okay. Impersonate. And now go to portal view and reload it. Now you cannot see this uh, administration category also. Now if I search create user. Okay. I can't see all the catalog items, any catalog item with create user. Okay, let's go back and impose native with ITIL user. Okay, impose native with another user called bet the line or ITL user. Okay, ITIL user. Okay, impose it. Now uh, go to home page service portal. Okay, I request something. Now you can see administration or user. Okay, so in this way, you can show catalog item only for certain role of users. Okay, let's end the impersonation. Go to again the catalog item, create user. Okay, so this user criteria you can define like for example, you want to show only for particular like few users like uh, ITL user or uh, few users like if you have user's name, you can use it or if you have group of users, you can add it in the group 
and you can define. If you have a particular role, you can define it. Okay. If you have companies like, for example, if so and so companies users can see. Okay. If so and so location users want to see. Okay. Department. Okay. Match all means like they need to pass any condition. Okay. They need to all the conditions if they define. Okay. Match all conditions. Advanced means you can write script. Uh, okay, for example, you can write script like js.user. Okay, get user details. If the user mail, okay, is from so and so vendor. Okay, if user is stayed in this location, particular location, so something like that, you can add script. L, okay, so in that way, you can define the user criteria record. Okay, so that is how you can show a catalog item only for particular users or not for particular users. Okay, that's it. Thank you. Please do subscribe to get alerts for upcoming videos. Hope you will enjoy and learn service now. Thank you very much for your time.